Good evening, everyone. Tonight, you're going to do something different. Actually, you're going to do a, quote, mail day video. Just showing what I got in recently. Got a bunch of stuff today, as well as a, a box or two the other day. So, we'll start off with the sports first, as you guys were used to in this channel, at least. One of the nicer things we got was uh, three rack packs of 1984 tops. Hoping to find, you know, a Mattingly rookie, as well as, you know, the Strawberry, etc. So, definitely watch for a video on those. Also got another box of 88 score after that last rip. You know, remembered how much I actually liked those cards. So, you know, I picked this one up. I think it was $14 shipped and, you know, it was cheaper if you wanted more. The seller actually wanted me to buy more of them, but I just didn't feel like spending a bunch of money on that right now. But... You know, they're readily available. If you look, you probably get them for, you know, $12, $15 ship. You buy more than even less. I think when you buy like three or four of them, they worked out, I think, $9 each shipped, which isn't bad, you know, for a box of cards, regardless if they're not really worth anything. And then we have two boxes of 93 OPG Premier. You know, I think I paid, you know, $22 ship for two of them. So it's not bad. You know, granted, once again, cards in there aren't worth a whole lot, but still not a bad pickup, I think. You know, it's worth the video at least. And then we have some non sport, something I just got into. I got bored the other day, decided uh, to start buying some non sport cards. Uh, one thing I picked up was uh, the Fringe sets. I don't know if you guys are aware, Fringe was a sci fi show on Fox. Picked up uh, the complete. This is season one and two here. I also got season three and four coming. Um, I might get into buying some of the memorabilia cards, the relics, etc., autos, as well as some of the packs. And then we also got some Walking Dead. Big fan of that. Little pig, little pig, let me in. Got uh, the season four master set, part one, part two, as well as all of the inserts. So I'll probably take a look at that in the video soon. And then we got a blaster box of the Walking Dead Evolution. I believe this is from 2017. Obviously looking for, you know, the chase cards in there, autographs, you know, relics, etc. And then we got a hobby box of Season 5. It includes, you know, guaranteed two hits per box, autographs, costume pieces, etc. And then we have a more obscure, well, at least obscure if you're not really into the sci-fi realm. Uh, 4400, the show from back, it ran, I think, 2004, 2007. We got uh, a wax box, uh, season one and season two. Uh, if you haven't seen the show, you know, it's pretty good if you're into, you know, sci-fi, etc. Uh, if you watched uh, the recent show Manifest, I think pretty much Manifest was based off of this series. You know, the main the premise of the series is very similar. A bunch, a bunch of people disappeared, and you know, a lot of them randomly all showed up back on the same date, all 4,400 at once. Pretty good series. It was canceled, I believe. Uh, the writers went on strike back in 2007, and at that point, they just canceled the series rather than try to restart it afterwards, just due to probably lackluster ratings. But still, it was kind of left off on a cliffhanger, which sucked. But you know, those things happen with a lot of sci-fi series, just because of you know waning demand. But you know, still going to be a fun set. I'll probably do a video on that here soon while I open those. And that's pretty much it, I believe. Um, yeah, I think that's it for right now. i got more stuff coming. I'll do another video here soon when the rest of that stuff comes in. And obviously we'll get some videos here going with me opening this stuff. Uh, any comments, questions, you know, requests, let me know in the comments below. And I will see you in the next video.